I'm here to talk about a book of poetry by Ada Lamon uh, called Bright Dead Things, uh, published fairly recently here in the United States, and we think it may come to England fairly soon too. Um, Ada was a high school person when I first met her, and she left to go to college. But as uh, news from her over the past 20 years gradually filtered back here, it turned out um, she was writing poetry, featured in the New Yorker magazine and the New York Times. That Ada is shortlisted for the National Book Award for this book of poetry, Bright Dead Things. The book is about belonging, it's about loss, um, it's about relationships, it's about those ordinary things that can be transformed into extraordinary things uh, when they're written by a poet. And Ada is a consummate poet, and I suspect she's been one since she was very, very young. But this book, in a very, very refreshing way, deals with the subject of belonging to a community, belonging in a relationship, and reacting to the ordinary things that go on around you. This poem is called Field Bling. Nights when it's warm and no one is watching, I walk to the edge of the road and stare at all the fireflies. I squint and pretend they're hallucinations, bright, made-up waves of the brain. I call them field bling. I was stunned when I read her poetry, um, and I hope that you will be stunned if you pick up this book, Bright Dead Things, Ada Lamont. She's from Sonoma, lives in Kentucky, and is exquisite poetry.